I'm Anil Kumar. We want to understand how to divide using fractions. And the model being selected is a number line at present. Use the number line to find how many two thirds are in six. Right? That is the question. So, so we'll use a number line. Let's say this is our number line. Okay. And we want to know how many two thirds are in six, right? So that is to say, if I start from zero, move positive numbers towards the right. Let's say this is one, and then this is two, uh, three, four, five, and let's say six. Since we want two thirds, means two third, right? How many two thirds are in six? So what we will do here is we'll divide this number line each unit into three equal parts right so you could say these are my three equal parts one two three so each is one third one third two third three third that means one right so so that is the division into three equal parts right so my diagrams are kind of approximate but they help you to understand the whole concept that's the beauty right now when we say how many two thirds so this is one third, two thirds. So first step, we could get one, like this is one, right? One third, two third. Then again, we can have uh, this one, one third, two third. Then again, we can have this one, and then this one, and then this one, and then like this, and like this, and like this, and like this. So how many are there? Let's count. So we have one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So the answer is nine. Do you see that? Nine. How did we get this number? Nine. Let's try to understand that part now. So we can say that we could get uh, nine two thirds are there in six. So basically, what we did was we had a number line with six units, right? And we divided them equally into two thirds. Do you see that? And what we got was nine. That is what we did. So basically, if the question is, how many two thirds are there? Let's concentrate on this part. How many two thirds are in six? That means divide six by two thirds, get your result, right? There are nine two thirds in six. So that is how you can actually use a number line to get the result. And what we can do is we can check with different methods. One of the methods is, uh, you know, reciprocal, right? Reciprocal relation, which is, uh, what is the reciprocal of division? It's multiplication, correct? So six times three over two. So when you multiply, Divide, divide they are reciprocal so multiply by reciprocal of 2 over 3 so what do you get you could simplify this first and then multiply dividing by 2 we get 3 3 times 3 is indeed 9 do you get the same result yes you do but I hope with this example you clearly understand when to divide and how to divide I'm Anil Kumar and I hope that really helps thank you and all the best